So we're not here to serve others. We're not here to do things for others. That may sound a little bit edgy, but live, work with me for just a minute. As a coach, you are not here to coach others for their sake. They will experience their own evolution and their own journey in experience with you. When they come into experience with you, when they come into the decision to work with you, they will have their own journey and not because of you or because of how you teach or anything. It will all be their own creation and you will be in experience with them having your own experience. So as coaches, decide what it is that you want to do. How, what do you want to express in the world? What feels good to you in your body? I think the number one thing that's coming through here is that as you are creating your business and choosing what you are doing next, please create it from within. Do not create it from what you believe others will receive or not receive from you or in an effort to inspire or change other people's lives. That is not what we are here to do. That is the side effect of us being in the fullest expression of who we are. But that is not what we are here to do. And that may seem a little uncomfortable and awkward to hear, but you will hear this body say that many times. We are here to be in the fullest expression of who we are. As someone who it, I believe that it sounds like you are a coach, it sounds like you're somebody who's teaching these things. As you are coaching, as you are creating the programs that you want to create, or as you are creating the offerings that you want to offer, as you are in experience with other people and clients that come into experience with you, what feels good to you? What feels incredible in your body? What, are, what, are the, what is the thing that you feel completely at ease expressing? So coming into the fullest expression of who we are is what we're here to do. We are not here to inspire others, coach others, or change other people's lives. They will do that on their own in experience with you. So for example, I will speak to my own experience. So me as a channel or whatever I'd like to call myself today, and I have clients that come and work with me, they are coming to work with me in their own state, in their own readiness to be in experience with me. I am here to be in the fullest expression of who I am. So what that means is that when I'm in experience with them, we've chosen to have an experience together. And if I'm expressing the fullness of who I am, the impact of that on their lives could possibly be them awakening to their own intuition. It could possibly be them awakening to a block that's within them that they've always had and never really understood and then suddenly they have an insight but it's not because of me it's not because of the program that i'm offering it's because of their readiness to be in experience with the truth of who they are we are limitless we are limitless now come along now the sky is endless now